evening, everybody, and welcome to this real estate investment seminar. I'm Larry Fullerton, and uh, Kyle, I think, decided because he looks so young that it would be appropriate to ask some old gray-haired guy to give a little credibility to him. So that's, that's why I'm here. Uh, I've been full-time actively involved in the real estate community in Denver for almost 35 years um, in more than one role. I've seen a few of you in my role as developer of lofts, and some of you, thank you, have sold a few of them for me. I appreciate that. Uh, and throughout a career like that, you know, I've been lucky in many ways, and the luckiest I've ever been is that I stopped in 2006. Uh, so I'm sort of a semi-retired developer, but currently I run a nonprofit called Book Communities, which is a 31-year-old Denver nonprofit that provides rental housing for low-income families in Denver. We own and operate a handful of apartment buildings, and that's how I met Kyle. But in a career like mine, every now and then you're blessed with certain things, um, one of which is being stars. And in my career, I've dealt with probably hundreds of residential brokers and all kinds of engineers and architects and marketing people and commercial brokers, and Kyle is a star. Uh, Kyle has, in fact, handled a few transactions for Hope, and in the past year and a half, I've gotten to know him, I think, very, very well. And I'm here uh, mainly just to introduce him. His bio is on the paperwork. I'm not going to read it to you, but I will tell you this that in my years working in Denver, which is a wonderful place to work, and there are a lot of good, good people there, uh, I've never come across a broker who works harder, who knows his product better, and cares more about his clients and customers than Kyle does. And he does it all uh, in a gentlemanly way, no matter what the situation. And these deals um, are not always the happiest and the calmest, but it's always a delight for me to see somebody who can conduct himself like a gentleman. Secondly, Kyle has showed to us, Hope Communities, that uh, his heart is in the community. He's spent half his time growing up here, went to school fairly nearby. But his heart's in the community. He's been very helpful to Hope, and he's brought other people in and been helpful to Hope. So I'm here, again, to tell you that uh, you're about to listen to and learn from a knowledgeable, exciting gentleman. And uh, I think you're the lucky ones tonight. So with that, I say thank you, Kyle, for letting me come in and say that. And have fun. Thank you. Thank you.